So one of the things that I always see people do when they play Bloody Roar or when they try to play Bloody Roar is that they heavy guard a lot. Now naturally it's okay to heavy guard because you're blocking light attacks and you're blocking heavy attacks. Now understand that there's only three buttons with Bloody Roar. Punch, Kick, and Beast. However, some punching moves, some kicking moves, and some beast moves do not have guard breaking properties and some do. Now, when an opponent or when the character is light guarding, which by the way, light guarding is always active, you don't have to press a button for it. They are blocking with one arm and there's a blue sphere there. That means light guard is active and you're not getting hurt from any light normals. However, uh, when they heavy guard, that means both arms are up and when a gold spark or a heavy attack, whatever you want to call it, comes at you and you heavy block it, your character's blocking with two arms and there's a purple sphere there. So keep that in mind. However, if you do not heavy guard, let's turn off heavy guard on the dummy. If you do not heavy guard and someone attacks you with a gold ring attack, your guard will be broken. Which is indicated by seeing the purple ring and your character stumbling back. Also, keep in mind that it's good to light guard these attacks that aren't heavy attacks because if you heavy guard them, you're putting more block stun on yourself. So you do not want to heavy guard these normals that are not heavy attacks. Another thing to be very mindful of is the fact that beast drives can also break your guard, such as Fang's and Yugo's Spiral Fang Beast Drive. As you can see right there, there's the purple ring indicating that the light guard was broken. They did not heavy guard it, or they didn't evade it. So, they took it. So, that's basically it. Thank you all for watching this. I just thought that this would be important to make because... I really feel like I didn't explain light guard, heavy guard, and guard breaks uh, that well. Um, in a prior guide, the command cancel one to be exact, because I talked about light guard and heavy guard in the beginning. Uh, but I felt like this video explained it a lot better. So yeah, thank you all for watching. I'll see you guys later, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And, you know, it, like I always say, uh, the convenient, the better. So, peace.